force to make an emergency landing after passengers engaged in a fight over another passenger accused of continuously passing gas or farting. So tell me, what, be your, what would be your, your reaction as a passenger if you were caught up in this situation? If I could just jump, I would just, I would just jump out of the plane or something like that. I would just try my best to maneuver out. So usually, like, um, let's just say I'm in... I want to go for a business meet. I'm in a hurry. I'm going to get angry because they have wasted my time. They are wasting my time. And then they need to definitely, um, I scheduled my time. So I need to get there by that time. So if they have to stop the plane or just land because somebody fat, no, I mean, I'm going to get ang angry. I'll be very annoying because I did not get to where I'm going. Um, so I have to take my money back. I, I, don't, I, don't, I, don't, I don't even know what to say. Like, I'll just be bored and I don't know what to say yet. I don't know. I just do you don't know what to say. Think about suing the airline. Of course, of course, be because it, it can't be because of one person you will drop everyone down just like that. Of course, I won't be happy, and then nobody will be happy in such a situation. So you just, but you can't help it. Then you just have to let things be, and then get an alternative to your movement. I will be very, very annoyed with him. If I have even the powers, I'll even slap him. Uh, that's what I'm going to do to him. How can he be releasing such dirty ass in this? <laughs> this has nothing to do with the airline company. This is a personal thing that nature. is nature, you know. And you could have even excused as saying, please excuse me. If you don't say excuse, everybody releases it. So if you, if you don't excuse and do it, then I have, I have all the right to do whatever, whatever I want to, to do, <laughs> including slapping him. <laughs> Okay, probably the last guy doesn't quite appreciate it. You're in an airplane and the guy is continuously doing it. It's not like he does it once or twice. It's happening. He's passing the gas and he's not stopping. That's a dangerous situation to be in. Now on Facebook, Kofi San says, seriously, I'll shout, oh my God, save my nose till we land. It will happen. But for those uh, who normally call God God, like Israel and his... <laughs> Oh my God! I know their uh, nose will not be saved. I know their nose will not be saved uh, since their prayers, since their prayers will be directed to the security companies. The young Rex says, "The iPhone 8 I bought from a shop at Circle today charged up to 103 percent. Then it switches off. Ah, what does it have to do with anything? <laughs> okay, Edward Kings was an unpleasant situation though." But I would have kept quiet and uh, stayed calm, like nothing has happened. I always do. After all, you can't cheat Mother Nature. Uh, Stephen Nair says, I guess the uh, said man suffered from one year constipation for a flatulence to cause emergency landing <laughs> of a plane. Uh, Kwesi Boateng Ayepa says, you eat beans and egg and top it up with liver salt for quick action. You come and sit by me and start misbehaving. Why wouldn't they bore uh, the man? He was trying to suffocate the passengers. <laughs> Munkaila says, uh, well, that's not my problem. My problem is how to get employment after graduation. So why comment? Exactly. Dan Clint. And leaving this comment here is supposed to guarantee that. Bravo. Maxwell says, if I don't treat that as suicide threat, what else can I say? It is. Thanks to the protesters. Dan Clint says, uh, hey, nothing. A fisher's voice, emergency land depart. Darlington says, I wonder most types released by Sule Nabe Salia, Baghdad province. Um, okay, I'm not, I'm not quite getting this bit. Uh, Eric Senior says, I'm shocked. And uh, Samuel Omari says, he, well, he just laughs it out loud. Mm -hmm.